Now, the National Crime Agency are investigating a cyber attack on the retailer Dixon's Carphone after the company admitted a data breach involving nearly six million payment cards. Uh, the company, which is also behind Curry's, says the cyber attack began last summer. Dixon's Carphone has apologised but said there's no evidence of any fraud as a result. Well, we're going to discuss this uh, right now with Randhir Shindi, CEO of Galaxy, a data protection and data management company. Thank you so much for being with us. Thank you, Ben. Um, first of all, tell us, how worried should we be? It, it, this sounds like a, an absolutely massive data breach. Yes, absolutely. Um, so when you talk of data breach, there are two elements to it. First is uh, financial loss, which is penalties to the company, uh, you know, fraud happening on your credit cards, uh, which have been lost. Uh, but the other is aspect is um, personal data that's lost is around 1.2 million uh, records of individuals which have been uh, has been hacked, and this these, this information is a breach of trust. And I think that's much more significant. Uh, you can um, get coverage of your financial losses by insurance companies and all, but who, who's going to cover your personal loss? Because hackers can get that information, get into your emails. Emails are your electronic DNA these days. So that's a much bigger loss. Of, loss and is of this trust. sort of data breach becoming more common in your view? Yes, it is. And um, if you if you consider uh, all the breaches that are happening in the last couple of years, um, loss of personal information is growing. And, and I think that's, that's something really concerning than financial loss, uh, because personal information is more critical than uh, financial loss that's happening over right now. Are companies doing enough, in your view, to protect themselves? Yeah, that's a very good question. Uh, with the GDPR uh, coming in um, in 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 place, uh, companies have started looking into that, but I don't think uh, all companies are ready yet, and and that's a fact of life. Uh, with the competitive world, everybody is in a race to have effective, uh, faster computing, and uh, they they just ignore uh, uh, data security, which is considered as a chore, and you know they don't want to invest over there. They want to invest in people. Because it's expensive and it, and exactly. it slows things down. Exactly. So that's that's the big problem which you have to overcome. Uh, and then the other aspect is uh, companies don't consider where data needs to be protected, because data is transmitted as well as uh, it's in store. It needs to be protected in both the places. It has to be encrypted. There's no other option. Uh, so it's really important for companies to consider that. Okay. Um, and the hackers, I mean, they're, they're making a lot of money out of this. It's, it's not, it's not, you can't uh, directly quantify they're making more money. Uh, they may affect you in the longer run with your data. You don't know what they're going, uh, going to do. I mean, they can make more money or harm you in some other way. So it's very difficult to quantify that. But yes, your personal information is compromised. Okay, Rand here, Shindi, uh, CEO of Galaxy. Thank you so much for talking to yeah, us. Yeah, thank you, Ben. Nice thank to you. see you.